Hi guys. Uh, I actually wanted to talk about one topic, but since it's a month that I filmed a video or at least at least uploaded one, I will be talking about the whole month of November. This will include a couple of things. Also, one thing that's particular for the Netherlands as we are celebrating here Sinterklaas. But I will give a little bit of information about it so you guys from America, Philippines and wherever other country you come from will understand what I'm talking about. <coughs> On the other side I will be talking about the killer clowns. Yes, I know it was a Halloween prank thing. But that's not all of it, so I will be talking of that too. Also a third topic which is more of a personal opinion probably than all the other ones other people say. But I have to say sorry guys because this is about you. So I will be starting with the guys topic so because it's a personal thing so yeah. A couple of weeks ago, or uh, actually the whole month of November, I went on a couple of dates with several guys. No, this wasn't because I'm a player, but this was more because I went on Tinder in October, all the way through October or something, and I talked to uh, uh, yeah, some guys and I thought, oh, they were really nice and stuff. So, um, so we went to meet somewhere and yeah, they came, but after yeah, the meet up or the date, that's what you want to call it, but I didn't hear anything of them anymore or at least not much and they were being assholes. So. I don't like guys anymore. Yeah, I will probably uh, have a boyfriend in the future, not a girlfriend. But I don't like the things they do, the tricks and that sort of stuff. So I don't know how about you other girls that watch my video. What do you think about boys? So leave that down in the comment section below, please. And now I will be talking about the Sinterklaas stuff. Here in the Netherlands, at December 5th, you celebrate Sinterklaas. It's a man with a white beard on a horse and he has, yeah, I don't know if you call it workers, that sounds a little bit racist, or friends, but at least I will leave pictures here in the video so you know what they like. But his companion, that's a better word to use, he, yeah, has dark hair and yeah, black or brown skin. This is not because we're racist and want the black or brown people to work. But it's an old story from thousands of years ago or something. But at least the original story was that Sinterklaas rescued the Zwarte Pieten from other people uh, where they worked for them and didn't have a good life. So it's not racist at all. But <coughs> by the way, the Zwarte Pieten are black from root. I don't know the English word for it right now, so I will leave it here in the video so you know what I mean probably. Root. Uh, charcoal maybe? I don't know. At least black stuff if you go clean your fireplace, the thing above it. Above it. So I hope you know what I mean at least. But since a couple of years, um, some people from other countries like countries like Morocco, 
Turkey came to here to the Netherlands and they yeah are black brown just what you want to call it and they started to complain that Santa Claus was racist and that we had to cut it out of our traditions and stuff but about five years ago you never heard it that Santa Claus was racist and stuff so I don't know why the people that come from all the other countries that are color colored let's call it that are now complaining about our traditions meanwhile we the Netherlands or the Hollanders has to adapt to their um, traditions and can't complain at all which sucks and now a Dutch person Sylvana Simons I think started to complain about it too but she yeah comes from Suriname and lives I don't know how much year here so I don't know what that bitchy wife want but yeah that really annoys me because it's just a kid's uh, party thing which is very nice for all the little uh, children here yeah also they want to um, color the pits in red blue yellow green that's not Santa Claus but uh, enough of my rant about Santa Claus let's go to the last topic the killer clowns I know you know we all know it actually was just a prank for Halloween but no in some countries or at least I know a family in America I don't know exactly where they live but I will leave a link down in the description to their channel so you can check it out for yourself but at least they are get on face killing cl killer clown they are stalking almo them almost every day the family by the way is a dad with three daughters one of the daughters you won't see that much in their vlogs because she doesn't want to be in the vlog vlogs that much so most of the time you see the dad and two of his um, daughters but the killer clown doesn't only stalk them he own uh, he um, steals also stuff that the dad or the daughters uh, purchase online and yeah was sent to them so that's not nice also he breaks in in the house he has break uh, broke several times doors windows I actually it's not funny anymore I really want to help this family but I really don't know how also because I live here in the Netherlands and even the police there can't do much because yeah the police lives 45 minutes or something away from them so I don't know but it's really annoying and this is going on for the last month or something if it's not more but I will like I said leave the link to their channel down below so you can check their videos out and see what this freaking clown is doing for yourself so I hope you like this video um, it was a little rant about several topsy topics but that was pretty much my month of yeah November also happy Thanksgiving today and eat loads of food and I will see you guys in the next video why did I copy Jacksepticeye I don't know but please leave a like subscribe and comment down below what you think about these topics and bye guys